Hello and welcome to Shunplay Sim Airport. Okay, so last episode we added this cafe area. So we've got a fantastic cafe area here. Oh, I've got, I've got some speakers that need connecting. Uh, we also built this store and this store here. And let's connect this to some of these that are not connected yet. There we go. Any more? Any more? Any more? No, it looks all good to me. Okay. Let's close that. So last episode we were trying to fix this bug where they were going up and down the stairs for some reason and what was going was they were walking in a loop for some reason trying to get to a seat here and then walking back and I fixed that by adding these one-way arrows and now there's one-way arrows everywhere which looks like a complete mess but if it fixes the problem we'll keep them there. I'm going to dismantle these walls now because I only put them in temporarily just to try and fix that problem. Where are you lot going? Oh, you're first class, that's fine. And you're first class as well. I was wondering why you're kind of like walking around everywhere. You're first class. Why are you pursuing the remote bag scanner? Hmm. Okay, maybe I need to assign these to these gates. Uh, not gates, scanners. And this one here. Assign, 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 assign. There we go. And assign that to that metal detector. That one to this metal detector. This one to this metal detector. And this one to this metal detector. There we go. I just don't understand why that first class passenger must have got... They must have got their ID checked here. And now she's kind of like walking. Yeah, look first class passenger so she would have walked <laughs> um, she would have got her ID checked downstairs because that's the only ID that she can only check that she can go to but now she's walking upstairs to get her bag scanned I don't know okay let's go back over to this part of the airport here this is starting to look good I'm quite pleased with how it's turning out we've got this gate here let's pause the game because it's almost midnight let's try and see how many flights we can fit on this gate actually before we do that let's expand this how do I expand it ground floor there's no difference between 260 or 250 or 240 but there is with 240 okay let's expand that is that just done no 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 and then I think I need to put a taxiway connection there for some reason. Okay, speed up. Can we get that built really quickly, please? As urgent priority. Um, actually, let me just pause the game. Can I get some flights? Okay, Aerostar. Yes, I can, I can. Even though it's not, f not fully built, I can get the flights. Okay. That's that's good to know. Um, which airline do we have flights with already? Rexy Canna. We've got five with you. Uh, we've got a 777. 400 passengers. Which ones are like the super one? 747. Here we go. Let's get this 747 and this 747 here. Now, as these are quite large flights. I'm going to give them let's give them a three hours and just see how that goes. I might expand it later. Or should I do three and a half hours? Let's do three and a half hours. Just because uh, with such a large flight, there's lots more that could go wrong. Mm, yeah. Yeah, we'll put that there. Okay. Uh, who else can we go with? Smart Air, we've got none from Smart Air, but these are large airlines, aren't they? So let's try one of these as well. A380s, how big is the Airbus A380? 525, let's do that one. Okay, and we'll fit this one here. Again, with 3 hours 30. And we'll get one in the morning as well. Who do we have lots with? Um, Rexy Canna, do you have a morning one? You don't. 
This hasn't updated, has it? Let's click off, click back on. 777. That's 400. I really want to try and get these bigger flights. These larger flights. Okay, what have you got? A380, I believe that's the... We've just said, yeah, 525. A380. Accept that. And let's put that as three and a half hours. There. Okay, we just need this to be built now. Look at my workmen all coming in to f get this runway built. Come on, it's an urgent job. We need it built. And we need this urgently built as well. Okay. Is it going to be built in time? It looks like it's going to be built in time. We've still got a few hours for it to be uh, built. This is under construction as well. Why did they stop doing this? Come on. 66%. Come on. Two thirds of the way there. Let's put this as high priority. And this one's high as well. Because as long as they build the airport, uh, not the airport, the uh, runway, that's the most important. Oh, they're, okay, they're just getting the last bits of equipment or materials to build it. There we go. We have a functioning runway all upgraded. These are being built. I am happy. Okay, let's go to our schedule. All our flights are en route, which is good to see. And they are all on our new date. No, gate D1. We don't want it as D1, do we? We want it as C2. There we go. Gate C2. Um, okay, I have no idea if ticketing and... Um, Security are going to cope with an extra 500 passengers, but we will see. Hopefully they will. It seems like it's going okay so far. Security seems to be going okay. There are some um, some minor queues at the ticketing desks, but nothing too major. How are the underground tunnels working? It seems to be fine. Yep, they seem to be sorting okay. We probably should upgrade this, but it seems to be fine. So I don't think that's a major problem. Okay, so now our large... Here we go. Let's just slow this down. Look how big this fuel... No, not fuel. Look how big this um, plane is. Taking up a huge amount of space. Let's go upstairs and have a look. Oh, look at this. We've got the uh, flight attendants. Flight flight crew got flight crew there got the pilot attendant pilot excellent look at all these people they are not even going to be able to oh that must mean the okay we're, re we're refueling as well which is great to see um, okay are we oh, are these bags is this still unloading? Okay, it's still unloading bags. Look at this. 124 bags to be unloaded. Is it unloading? Oh, look at this. This is going to be... This is going to be a huge amount of bags that are being unloaded now, isn't it? There we go. All coming through our system. Let's go to baggage claim. Okay. We are underground. There we go. Here are the bags. Oh, look at this. We've got, we've got bags coming up from two different inputs and they're being sorted into two, two different places. Uh, okay, there we go. And they are all arriving in baggage claim. That's looking good. I'm quite pleased with that. And how is the ticketing area f finding it? It's okay. Uh, security is busy. Okay, it is quite busy. Now, from looking at it, it's the ID that is the problem here. We don't seem to have many problems with people getting through the metal detectors. So maybe we need to put another ID check stands. Uh, maybe two more ID check stands in. Um, we can put... Um, let's put... One more on this side or should we start from this side? Let's put, let's put the two from this side. Okay, speed up. 
yeah, it's, this is a lot of people. A lot of people to get through. Okay, let's assign, uh, I believe, these are all assigned to here. Yep, so we'll assign these to 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And then this side will be assigned to this side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, to equally split the people through. And we'll also assign that to the gate, not the gate, the queue, and that one to that queue there. Yep, I'm happy with that. And then we need to hire two more staff. One, two, hire. Okay. Uh, speed that up. It's not, it's not, you know, it's not horrendous. They are getting through. It's not like the queues are, well, they are getting almost full, but they're not completely full. Let's look at the flight status. Oh, we had two people, oh no, we haven't got two people missing yet. Which is gate B3. Where's B3? Highlight passengers. The last one's just made it. That's all good. This one was five minutes departing late. Uh, gate A2. I like passengers. They're on the way. It's not a problem. Still got time to leave. 8.50. 10, uh, departing at 10.10. Yeah, we've still got plenty of time. It's all good. Okay, speed up. This is all running really, really well. I'm really pleased with how everything is going. We've got the cafe area all busy. People eating and... Um, in fact, I had some spare chairs, didn't I? I forgot to put those back in. Two in stock. I'll put one here and one here. How are the shops doing? People, yep, we've got people buying. I'm pleased about that. C2. Okay, taxi in. Here we go. Rexicana Air... 9486 Why is it, what's going on here? This is not connected There we go You probably need to get some more um, stairways down because they can't all fit in the stairways But it's not a, it's not a big problem the, the major issue, not issue, but the, the main concern is getting people up into the terminal building because we want them to be able to get to the actual um, planes as quickly as possible. This is interesting, isn't it? Most people are not using this top one. They're all using the middle one. Oh, no, this person is using this one. But most people... Who's this? Oh, the janitor. The janitor doesn't want to use it. But most people are using the middle one. And there's a few using this top one here, but no one is using this one here, which is quite interesting. Okay. Did that one leave on time? Yep, 100% boarded. This has still got plenty of time. Okay, we are we are going well. I, I think that's not a problem. If it's just five minutes late, it's not an issue. We are currently halfway through the day. Halfway, th halfway to getting a perfect bonus, hopefully. Ticketing areas coping fine. Security is coping fine now with these two new extra desks. Uh, there is a queue for the metal detectors and bag scanners though. So it looks like we might need to start to think about expanding security this way if this continues. Hmm. And I'm wondering actually, maybe I could get some stairways down on this side of the terminal so then these people don't have to walk all the way up, they can just walk straight here and down. But we'll see. Which is looking fine so far. We've got three million in the bank. <laughs> which is absolutely crazy. Why have we got so much money? Let's start putting down some um, some foundation. We might as well... Yeah, let's put foundation here. Foundation in here. Um, we want some foundation here. And then foundation here. There we go. Just to future proof um, this, because this is going to. I would want to get these small gates to large gates so we can actually put um, a small terminal up here. Some gates, I mean, up here. Um, so all the gates are on level one. 
and then all of the shopping and retail and cafes are on floor two, uh, sorry, ground floor. This is all looking good. Everything is going really well. Let's go back to off. Um, okay, look at this. This is all working really, really well. Just got the last few flights of the day. Now I'm hoping that all these last few flights will leave on time. Everyone is getting through security. No one is in ticketing. It looks like we will get a perfect bonus for the day. Just apart from this one here, but I believe I once had one slight delayed flight. Not even delayed, but you know, left slightly late and it was fine. Okay. Our final flight of the day. Our WestJet flight. Is it going to leave on time? Let's have a look. Yes, it did. Let's go to our um, finance hub. Perfect bonus. Day 65 is nearly finished. And day 65 is a perfect day. There we go. This is what I've been looking for for such a long time. Um, let's have a look at gate C2 for yesterday. Can I reduce any of these? So I've been giving them an hour and a, sorry, three and a half hours because they are quite large flights, but they seem to be coping fine. Uh, C2. Um, yeah, so that's almost an hour early. Oh, that's C1. I want C2. C2. Uh, 3.30. Yep, that's an hour early. C2. I think that's the same one. C2. This was over an hour early. Next to C2. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so this C2 was not uh, not over an hour, but about 50 minutes. 51 minutes. Um... Yeah, so 51 minutes is a, a good amount. I think I think I'll just leave them for now. Let's have a look at our flight schedules. Can we can we squeeze in some more flights? Let's have a look. We should start getting some early morning flights actually. Super Alliance, some early morning flights. We've got a 747, which is huge, and an A380. Let's get these two early morning flights in. Um, let's put them in as just three hours because it's early morning. There's no one else in the airport. Um, yeah. We can squeeze both of them in there. Let's move that up, actually. There we go. Um, can we get another early morning one? 747, I think it's quite, s not not really, s oh it is, okay, yep. Let's get that one in as well. I'll put this one here. Three hours. There we go. Um, I think these are all um, extra large. So these are large spark jets, 707, 180 passengers. You know what, let's leave it for now. Let's speed up time. I wish I did that actually before midnight because then they would have arrived today. But never mind. They will arrive at some point. Let's go upstairs. Let's get some foundations put down here. And down here. And have a nice wide area for people to relax waiting for their airport, uh, air airplane. Now, this isn't... This is too small. Far too small. Okay, let's get some flooring down. We need some flooring um, under construction. Floors. And we want this kind of wood here. Now that our income is so high, it's just kind of like really easy. Not having to wait. There we go. And let's put flooring down here. You know what? I also think we should get a larger fuel tank as well. Let's go to utilities. 
yeah, it's going to be half a million. It's going to be a big investment, but it is definitely required. Um, let's, pop, let's pop that there. And this is going to be able to hold 1.6 million litres of fuel. So we're never going to be out of fuel. <laughs> it's a lot of fuel. It's also a lot of fuel just having a big tank right next door to the ATC tower. Uh, but yep, we're going to take that risk. The kind of risk taker that I am at this airport. Nice. Um, okay, what else we need to... F let's dismantle some of these internal flooring. These internal walls as well, because we don't need these here. We don't even need this here now, do we? Let's dismantle this. Let's get rid of these walls. We'll keep the kitchen in the middle. Dismantle this here. Let's dismantle this here. Look, we've got the same issue up here of people walking up and down for no reason. I wish I could fix that. But clearly they're wanting to sit down, so they're going upstairs to sit. But then they're full, so they're going back downstairs. Uh, I don't quite know how to solve that problem. Okay, let's get the flooring done for these little gaps here and this gap here okay slow down what's wrong with this airport coach have I have I have I completely messed up or something what's going on must be in a secure okay pause 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 must be in a secure area this is a secure area. What do you mean it must be in a secure area? Have I dismantled something that I wasn't supposed to dismantle? No, everything's fine. Security is... is that's, that's security there. That is secure here. Okay, how do I get? To, how do I view the secure sector? In protected. Why is this protected and not secured? What's going on? Um. Okay, I think this is a bug, but look, this is all secured. This should be this should be secured, not protected. Right, I'm, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to restart the game, and I'll come back. Okay, I've restarted the game, and it's still saying it's only protected and not secured, and I don't quite understand why. Oh, oh, oh! I have accidentally deleted the staircase. That is not good. Okay, staircase down. Put that as urgent. Okay, there we go. Oh, that's... Okay, so this now needs to... Um, <laughs> board in 30 minutes to make sure that it leaves on time. I have completely messed that up. That was my fault. I accidentally removed the staircase. It's now going to be late. Let's highlight where everybody is. People are are arriving. Oh, this is delayed. Okay, say goodbye to... Um, <laughs> say goodbye. Oh, in fact, we could say goodbye anyway because that um, first flight missed one passenger. So... Ah, oh, so frustrating. So frustrating. Never mind. I tell you what would be quite nice if if we could specify that these benches are only for people waiting at this gate, and then that way that would solve the problem of people walking up and down for no reason to get to here. We need some. Um, you know what I'm going to do in terms of the problem with toilets. I'm going to put an underground toilet here, I think. 
Shall I do that? That would save so much space. Just have one stairway down and just say this is where the toilets are. But the problem is if I do that, then if I do want to rearrange all this bag baggage system, it might be a bit of a tricky thing to do. Probably not the best. Hmm. But I do need some more toilets because this is not enough. Let's let's build some walls down here and here. We'll have some male toilets here so we can have a walkway up and down. And let's just build some more up here. You know, let's build it all the way down here. And we can have a shop here and a cafe. We'll put a, we'll move the cafe over to here. And we'll put a big shop in the middle. Let's do that. Okay, so what do I need? I need doors. One and two. Need some stools. Ah, this is not gonna be It's not gonna be wide enough, is it? Okay, it's gonna go like that. Um sinks. <laughs> These sinks are terrible. Um, there we go. It's, it's going to be a bit of a squeeze, but that you just have to deal with it. Okay, female restrooms. And this is going to be a male restroom. Let's get some stools put in. We'll have three stools at the back. We'll get some urinals along here and maybe don't know what happened to that one here Use some sinks three sinks there perfect there we go that now we should hope relieve some of the space in here and let's get this one sorted as well let's get some stools in some urinals put in and some sinks kind of like just dotting around really but it will be fine Put one here. And we need a door to go just here. And this is going to be a male restroom. Okay, let's dismantle all of that. Let's fix this floor. Where's the flooring? Okay, wood. 05B to go here and all down here. You know what? I'm going to move this cafe, so let's just change this flooring now. Um, yeah, that will do. Let's dismantle all of this and this bin. Yeah, there we go. This is starting to look much better. Do we need this wall here? We don't need this wall, do we? We've got like a... Some kind of like... Small wall around these areas anyway. So that's fine. Let's dismantle this and this. Okay, and we need to remove this zone as well for the toilets. Okay, finally, this airport is actually going to look a little bit more like an airport. Okay, let's get some shops in. So, store. Let's have one store here. And then we're going to have the cafe right next to it. Here. No, actually, we're going to have the cafe in the corner. And the store. Here. So people have to walk through the store to get to the cafe. Yeah, we'll do that. 
Let's dismantle this door here. And let's remove the zone. Okay, cafe. I want them to dismantle it first so I'm not having to purchase it again. Okay, three registers. Let's put the let's put the registers over here. Which way around do I want it? This way. One, two, and three. Um, the drinks. I want two drinks machines here and here. Coffee. One coffee machine here. And then we want some chairs, don't we? Um, no, hot food display. Again, what I'm going to do. Which way around does this go? Can't quite tell. Put two here. Chilled food, food, that's what it's called. And two here. So what they can do is they can walk up grab it and then they can go and queue. Let's get the queue system sorted. Let's go through here. There we go. So they grab their food, they go queue up and then they can get the drinks as they go to the counter. Sign the queue to the cash registers. Oh, come on, get out of the way, get out of the way. There we go, and assign. Now we need some chairs. Okay, object cafe. Let's have these ones. Oh no, let's actually, we've already bought a load of these, so let's use these. Hmm, it's going to be quite a tight fit, but it is what it is. Chair. There we go. We can fit one more just there. It's a, it's a lot smaller than it was before, but it will be fine. Oh. <laughs> oh. What an idiot. Yes, you've probably been watching this and screaming at your screens. Oh, dismantle. Right. Dismantle it all. Let's try that again, shall we? Let's give it a second try. Okay, so I want to have cash register. Okay, it wants to be this way. And we'll put the cash registers here, here, and here. Drinks machines. We'll put them at the back. Coffee machine. Put it at the back. Chilled food display. We'll put them here and here. Hot food display. We'll put here and here. Okay, there we go. Then we get the queue. Oh, what an idiot. We'll put the queue kind of going down to here. So they can walk in, get the stuff, and then walk to the top. Oh, dear me. Okay, cafe tables. We'll put some rows in. One, two, three. And then we'll put kind of like them down here. Um... Actually, oh, what am I, I hate. I wish when I push escape, it would just cancel the. Uh yeah, we'll do that. Do something like that. That will do. Okay, we'll get some cafe chairs. Cafe, uh, these wooden ones. How many have we got in stock? Twenty-two. That's plenty. Okay, let's put three at the bottom. Three above these tables. We'll put one at the end of the tables. We'll put two here, two here, two here, two here. I'm going to cancel these two tables at the end. Okay, that will do. 
yeah, that's fine. People can walk through there. Okay, what's going on here? We need to sign the kitchen. Okay, assigned to that kitchen. This kitchen is kind of in a weird spot. It's bang in the middle of our terminal. We probably should move it. Um, it might have been nice actually to move underground, out of the way. But I'll leave it there. It's fine. Okay, this is now being stocked up. Um, our workers should arrive soon. Right, let's get this retail store going as well. Object retail. Cash register. Let's get two cash registers in here. It's strange that you can't put them against this wall here, but you can put them against the back wall here. I don't think this cash register is assigned to the queue, is it? Come on. Okay, assigned to the queue. Sign to the queue. Come on. Come on. Sign to the queue. Uh, oh, this is quite busy now. We might need to uh, um, expand this queue actually. We'll expand it to there, because that way it kind of like goes along all of the food. I know it's not perfect, but it will do. Okay, I'm looking, I'm liking that so far. Okay, let's go, let's focus on this store then. What's this box? Chilled food display. Let's sell that. Okay, we need to have um, objects, retail. Cash register. Let's put the cash register over here, actually. Let's have two. And what we're going to do over here is sell books, candy, um, what else do we have? Some makeup. Some pharmacy stuff. Put those behind as well. Some souvenirs. Because you always find these souvenir stuff inside of um, airports, don't you? And... Yeah, that will do. And then finally, we're going to have to hire two more retail workers for those two new tills. Okay, let's check the routes for today. Oh, are these our early morning flights? Oh, I was so busy. I was so busy. I wasn't even looking at these early flights. It seemed like they all arrived and departed on time, which is great. Um, we always seem to have one person missing from this flight here. I don't quite know why. Okay, how security? Security seems to be fine. Perfect. Well, those early morning flights didn't seem to actually affect the airport overall. Okay, look, we've now got people buying stuff from our store. How much? Uh, okay, I say buying. No one's bought anything yet, but we have it open, ready. Uh, let's remove this queue. There we go. What's this one random box? Statue B. Oh no, I don't want to... Okay, let's get this statue. Why are they not putting it into storage? It's really strange. Okay, so let's leave it there because this has this episode is probably the longest one I've done so far. Nearly 40 minutes and um, still going. I try to... I try to keep, keep these episodes between 25 minutes and 30 minutes at the maximum, but I got a bit carried away today. So, what have we been working on? We have completely reorganised this m first part of the terminal. We have moved the toilets, increased the toilet capacity because we did not have enough before. We've moved the cafe, moved the store, um, and we have managed to completely mess up upstairs here. But overall, 
um, I'm quite pleased. I want to get some more seating area inside here. That probably can be done next time. Probably move the seating upstairs to be fair. Um, so yeah, that's looking all good. We'll pause it there. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, cl please click thumbs up. C consider clicking subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And thank you very much. See you next time.